And we are back. It's been a long time, Haseo. Or maybe I should call you the Terror of Death. You've gotten quite strong, a lot stronger than you were back then. Well, I was forced to become stronger, thanks to you. You, where have you been? Haseo, always the reliable one. I knew I could count on you. When the Twilight Brigade broke up, why didn't you come then? What have you been doing the last six months? I was busy. It was such a small seed. I needed to find out what was growing inside. And there was only one way to find out. That's why I decided to raise it. You raised it? What are you talking about, Ovan? I'm speaking figuratively. When you suddenly disappeared, we all just... Why did you disappear like that? After that, Shino... Haseo, do you want to know about Triage? Wait, you know Triage? Six months now, and Shino hasn't come back to the world since Triage killed her. Meanwhile, the real-life Shino is lying in a coma, and no one seems to know the reason why. Triage. He is not a normal PK. So you knew about Shino? Yes, but that's all that I know. But if you were able to find Triage, you might learn something about Shino's coma. You may also learn more about what really happened that day. And if you were somehow able to defeat Triage, then maybe Shino would come out of the coma. If my information is correct, he will be back today, at the scene of the crime. The scene of the crime? You mean... Delta Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. The place where Shino was killed. The Holy Grand's Cathedral. Yes, finally! I'll get my chance! I swear I'll bring Shino back! I'll do it, Ovan! Yes. You and I, we're the only ones who could possibly bring her back. We're the only ones. <laughs> Ovan? I'll meet you at the Holy Ground. There are some things I must do. He will be back today, at the scene of the crime. Triage is coming here! Who knows? 
knows? Maybe she just lost her interest. Lost hope for this world. What's that sound? So that was a long cutscene session. And again, welcome back to episode 2 of the Todd Hack series. I apologize for being silent. Well, I know it's courteous too, but you know, I'm new. So if I'm not silent during the cutscenes, I apologize. I was trying to be courteous. I'm, you know. Again, new to all this stuff. So yeah, let's jump right back in and let's see what happened. Huh? What the? I was fighting Triage, but then... Damn it, I can't remember. Huh? I don't remember doing that. Reformatted? What's going on? What about my emails? Never delete these? They're all gone? 
Even the emails I got from Shino. Everything's been reformatted. What the hell is going on? An email? Fine, let's take a look. Ovan? Alright. <clears throat> there are two paths before you. One of these will lead to safety and shame. It is a path where you give up to the world and never log in again. The other path leads to peril and crime. It is a path where you continue the world and resume your search for the truth. Let me be blunt. The latter path is torturous and will threaten both your mind and body. Once you have chosen it, there is no turning back. If you still choose to walk this path, then there will come a time where you and I will once meet again in the world. When the time comes, I will once again say this to you. Welcome to the world. Trial and truth. Whether or not I should quit the world? You should know better, Ovan. I'm gonna go back to the world. And then, I'm gonna get Shino back, no matter what! Basically, how I view that email is... The devs are saying, you can quit the game now, and get a GG, you beat the game. Or continue playing the game, and get the truth in the game. We're going for the true ending. Oh, that was a quick save. Oh, so much better than PS, PS2 and PS1. I mean, PS4. Oh. Okay, so what can we do in here? Uh, I have nothing in there. Background. I have nothing in there. Cool. If you've never ever played any of the Dot Hack games, I've never played the original ones. I want to, but I never have. This one actually works and plays like an online game, but it's not. There are actual events in the game that take place on the forums, and you actually have to go to the forums and find them. There are actual events that take place in the mail. And yes, we will be coming back here a lot. And I do mean a lot. There will be parts where we have to... Not, not a whole lot, but maybe like once or twice where we have to come here and read the news. I think. I could be wrong on that. But there's a couple of times where they mention... Where they mention like a part of the storyline going on here and everything else. And they might mention something else. I, I don't remember if I wasn't going to play. But yeah, other than that, this... Uh, there's also this as well, to where you can replay the cutscenes. That's all they have. That's all I've unlocked. But I've seen several cutscenes. Why aren't they there? That's weird. Go ahead and see if I can just why not. Huh. That does not jive with how long I've been playing the game for. Interesting. And it's also a card game. Doesn't matter to the game at all. Wish it did, but it does not. And here's the actual forums and the actual site. And sometimes you'll need to come back here and do things to get new words. Actually, not get any words at all. By the way, and no, you don't have to actually do this and do this. You can just do that and it's done. Which is 
nice. But is there any new... Yep, see? New words. Actually, I want to go back over here and do the same thing. Because I might get new words to go to. Yep, that's a quest. And here is R1 is for is basically the original Dot Hat games. I'm hoping they remake those. I really want to play them. And please, can we get more? Can we get more Dot Hat games? And I'm not talking like a freaking Mortal Kombat fighter or whatever the hell they did. And then they said, we're done. Like, no. I want more like this. Hope there's more in here. There's more in here. News. I don't think anything has to do in there. Force of Pain. Urban Legend. And none of this changes. Like you can start a new game and this is all the same stuff. Unfortunately. But hey, whatever. And here's art you can you can get for your background. Like that. It is always the same. But personally, I don't care. Now to do this again. And yes, I will be saving a lot. Login. Don't say that. What's going on? Why is my equipment different? One? What about my items? My member list? My equipment? <laughs> gone. It's all gone. My whole character has been completely reformatted. Hey, did you see that guy just now? With the really weird arm? <laughs> totally! Huh? Ovan? He would know something about this. Alright, I'm back. So basically, we are now level 1 again. Haseo was max level 150, I think. They never really said. I'm assuming he was. Why is this a thing? Why? You can't walk in it, so why is it a thing? Oh yeah, uh... Now you cannot save here at all. You have to go to either a save spot, or an NPC, or log out and save. So yeah, we'll be doing a lot of... Hey, do you know what that guy's job was? I don't think I've seen a design like that. I didn't look that closely. I saw him head towards the harbor. Maybe I'll go get a closer look. So, this part right here is just running around, getting you used to the layout of the city in my opinion. Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. But it's basically to you know, get you used to how the city looks and all that. And the controls as well. 
because you never really got to mess with the controls that much in the beginning. It was mostly a big old fat tutorial. Oh my god, that player looked really hot! Really? I thought he looked kind of creepy. So, you like guys that look like that? <laughs> Where'd he go? Uh, I think he went down that alley. Careful, it could be a, a dude in disguise. You never know. The year is... I don't know what year it is in the game. Huh, I don't know. Oh yeah, the NPCs do talk. And you can trade with them too. Actually, what do you have? Ooh. I never use these at all. Or those. There's just no point. Because you do more damage without elements. Because you're going to fight one enemy that is weak to fire or water or whatever. And the next enemy is strong against that enemy. So it's like, it's not worth it. And then, damn, it's those player killers. Huh, it's not much of a challenge when they're so pathetically weak. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. Fighting those noobs is making us all rusty. That rogue that we fought the last time? He really wasn't that bad. Um, you mean we're going after him next? Hell yeah. Hmm. There is no way in hell. I can back down after what happened last time. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Wait, Excuse me. what the hell am I hiding for? Why do I have to hide from bastards like them? It's pathetic. Because you're level one? That's why? You're kidding! What the hell's going on? Gaspard, are you okay? Oh, huh? What happened? Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Hey, are you a new player? You're a noob? Oh, <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. I guess I must have scared you, huh? Hell no, I'm not a noob. I'm the terror of death. Terror of what? What? Wait, are you talking about the famous PKK, Haseo? Oh, you're a player killer killer! I knew I'd heard about him somewhere before. But I'm pretty sure the player's name was Haseyo. Are you sure? Definitely. Yep. Hey, look. It's me. I'm the real PKK Haseo. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you'll have to gain more levels before you can say anything like that. What? Hey. If you're a noob, we'll be happy to teach you the basics of this game. Actually, <laughs> Syllabus and I are part of the Noob Support Guild called Canard. Noob Support Guild? It's a guild that teaches noobs all they need to know to become top players. We're actually pretty famous, you know. Oh yeah, I need to give you our member addresses first. Here. Now why couldn't he have gotten a welcome like this when the game first started? Things would have gone a lot more smoothly. Member addresses are an address system. Oh, man. Just for communicating it's just with your my luck to get world. mixed up with when a bunch of weirdos. Party, check their status I even lost sight of Ovon. Anyway, right now, I've got to level back up to become the Terror of Death. Can do. Well, I guess I'll just hang out with them for a little while longer. Look, it doesn't mean that they'll join just because you invite them to. 
Um, were you listening to me? Nope. Yeah, I was listening. You were? Really? Yes, really. Anyway, come on. You're going to teach me the basics, right? So hurry up and let's move on to the next lesson. Okay, then let's go to an area. Now, invite us into your party and we'll go find the Chaos Gate. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and put another cut in here and I'll be right back.